Hey buddy. and fam today is my turn for the day in the life a day in the life for homeschooler middle schooler and in american samoa so my day started off with waking up eating breakfast getting you know getting ready for the day then my mom took had to get to school there they go bye mom and now she's back but before I go any further, grab a dumbbell that you use to work out with and hit the like button and the subscribe button. And don't forget to ring our little notifications bell down in the bottom. Now it's time for my workout. Five pull-ups, five bicep curls, five push-ups, five sit-ups, and I run up and down the stairs three times, but I repeat that five times. I repeat all of that stuff. Let's go! some schoolwork. As a homeschooler here, our our schedule is pretty open, so we can add some things into it like this. This thing that we're going to at the museum is hosted by the Visitors Bureau of American Samoa. It's called Explore, Experience, and Enjoy the Art of American Samoa. Let's go check it out.
they just made my day. They were so awesome to let me keep this. So I was actually painting a lay that's like, um, like a lava lava basically, I guess. That's what I think of it. All right, where to now? Mm, the beach. The beach, why? Because I have dog dookie on my foot. <laughs> you stepped in dog poop? Yeah. <laughs> gonna go wash off the feet and then where to next? We're gonna get some lunch and then head over to Fa to Tafuna to sell some books. When we first moved here, my parents homeschooled us for one year, then they moved us to traditional school at Tafuna Elementary. We were there for two years, we made some friends, then we moved to Coconut Point, and then we started going to Montefiore Elementary. I have ADHD and it makes me makes it harder for me to focus, but I take pills, which make it so that I can focus better. I guess I just wasn't taking the right amount, or like I just wasn't working hard enough, or my teacher didn't have enough patience. So my parents decided to homeschool. The homeschooling was going so well that me and my parents decided that I should be homeschooled for another year and hopefully another year after this year. Mm -hmm. I love how like easy it is to get my work done unless my mom forgets to assign me my assignments. Then I have to wait for a little bit longer. It goes pretty well because I don't have to wait for my other classmates because I don't have any other classmates. And I also get to have like more of a say of what classes I take, I'm taking because like if I was just like in traditional school, I wouldn't get to really choose. So right now I'm taking math, sixth grade math. Sixth grade math. I'm taking electrical engineering. I'm taking world history and, and I study language arts art and PE. You saw me working out this morning. I need to do that. And I do either a bike ride or I run. I also learn how to speak different languages. Like? Like Spanish through podcasts. And I also learned how about like economics through podcasts too. And I read. I also learn how to do ukulele. I can do You Are My Sunshine pretty well right now. So, my, my sunshine. Oh, but the main thing that I love about it is that I get to be with my mom and my dad all the time. So the things I miss about traditional school is I don't get to really have any friends at like homeschool because I can't really make any friends unless like it's um activity. I also miss being able to participate in like class parties or science fairs. I love science fairs. I don't really miss the dances. <laughs> Some days. My mom has to run some errands and stuff like that, but, and like sometimes she has me come with her. Today we're going to sell some of her books. It's called Explore America Samoa, the travel guide. We went to the and Shark gift shop and we got a donut. <laughs> so if any of you guys are here in America Samoa or want to come, check out my mom's books. Explore American Shamoa the Travel Guide. I turn in Shark Gift Shop or Forge Green.
to get preparing for our boat and selling books. So now we're heading to the library to get my schoolwork done finally and mom to get her work done, like maybe editing on this very video. And Hattie and Kip are going to meet us there and then we're going to head home. Now it's time to get some chores done, sadly. Well, my chore is trash. It's chores table and I had these chores floor. And after chores, get some free time before dinner or some free time after dinner if we get our chores done. about to get ready for bed but from seven o'clock to eight we get screen time we get to play on our devices i like to play minecraft among us and i like to play worms three those are probably my my top three games that i like to play okay guys thanks for tagging along with us now we say tough fossil